This is calculator question number 22. College Board describes three numbers whose sum is 855 and one number x is 50% more than the sum of the other two. I'm going to call the average of the two other two numbers y. So we have x plus y plus y equals 855. And in my, my mind, I'm informally treating it as if the two remaining numbers are both equal to y because that will not change the answer and it makes it easier to think about. So the sum of three numbers is 855, and x is 50% more than the sum of the other two. So that's 1.5 times 2y, so x equals 3y. Substituting 3y in for x in this first equation, I get 3y plus y plus y equals 855. 5y equals 855. If I divide both sides by 5, that gives me y by itself. y equals, I'll check on the calculator, but I think 171. Yes. Now that I have y, I know that x equals 3y. x equals 3y, so x equals 3 times 171 is 513. And to check my answer, which is b, I'm going to find x plus y plus y. Adding those 3, 4, 5, 5, 8, 855, which is the correct sum. So y equals 171 is correct, and x equals 513 is correct, and 513 is the answer that College Board was looking for. College Board often gives you this sort of problem where you have to work through the logic to find the values. So make sure you read these carefully. And come back soon for my next video with math there's always more.